In April of 2018, Ubisoft released the Thatcher Elite set. This Elite set was titled Operation Nimrod, and in today's video, I'm going to be telling you the origin of this Elite set and the real life Operation Nimrod. Operation Nimrod is actually the Iranian Embassy Siege. This siege took place from the 30th of April to the 5th of May 1980, after a group of six armed men stormed the Iranian Embassy in South Kensington in London. These men were part of the KSA group campaigning for Arab national sovereignty in the southern Iranian region of Kuzikstan province. These men took 26 people hostage. Most of those people were staff of the embassy, however some were visitors and one was a police officer defending the embassy. They demanded the release of Arab prisoners from the prisons in Khuzestan and their own safe passage out of the United Kingdom. However, Margaret Thatcher's government resolved that there would be no safe passage granted and a siege ensued. Over the following days of the siege, Police negotiators secured the release of five hostages in exchange for minor concessions, such as the broadcasting of hostage takers' demands on British television. By the sixth day of the siege, the gunmen had become increasingly frustrated at the lack of progress in meeting their demands, but that evening, they killed one of the hostages and threw their body on the streets of Britain. As a result of this, the government ordered that the SAS, a special regiment of the British Army, to conduct an assault known as Operation Nimrod. SAS soldiers abseiled from the roof of the building and forced entry through the windows. During the 17 minute raid, they rescued all but one of the remaining hostages and killed five of the six hostage takers. The soldiers later faced accusations of unnecessarily killing two of the five, but an inquest into the deaths eventually cleared the SAS of any wrongdoing. The sole remaining gunman was prosecuted and served 27 years in British prisons. And now that brings us to today. In Rainbow Six Siege, a lot of this stuff is based off real life events and you can see some of this stuff reflected in the maps that have been made, especially the ones at launch. And now we have this Elite Thatcher set and it's a really nice homage to the SAS soldiers who put their life on the line during that siege and it's really good that games like this can respect them and honor them in a way like this so that's all i really want to talk about in this video um if you didn't know about this now you know every elite skin in this game has an actual history to it if you didn't know that so that was the history of thatcher's elite skin um if you guys want any more elite skins talk about the past of them talk about the origin um comment below which one you want here i'll make a video on it um, I actually find it very interesting. I actually really like when an elite skin comes out and looking into their history, I find it very interesting. So uh, yeah guys, if you did enjoy this video, please subscribe, like, notifications, share with friends, yada yada yada, you get the drill. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Yeah, thanks for watching.